Alrighty guys, what is up? We are at Six Flags New England today. This is my third Six Flags park this year. As you know, we kicked it off on March 30th with Six Flags Great Adventure opening day. Then June 17th, we went over to Six Flags America. And now we're over here and next month, we're at, next month, uh, we're going to Six Flags over Texas and Six Flags Fiesta, Texas. But I'm very excited. I'm gonna come, uh, I'm gonna get three new credits here today. Um, so I'm gonna try and get on the Kitty Coaster if they let me. I'm gonna get on the Vacoma SLC here. Uh, Riddler Revenge and I'm also gonna get on their free spin here, which is Joker So it's gonna be my second free spin and I'm also riding two more both of them in Texas next month uh, But yeah, I'm pretty oh look at that. They have a Fright Fest car here Pretty cool, but yeah, I'm pretty excited for Six Flags New England today. I haven't been here in two years So it's definitely been a while But uh, Six Flags New England is definitely one of my favorite parks I've been to and it's probably my favorite Six Flags park I've been to I know Great Adventure is my home park, but New England ju there's just something about New England how uh, it has like a different feel and uh, it really doesn't feel like a Six Flags Park um, But uh, yeah, I'm pretty excited and I uh, will see you guys once we get into the park All right guys, we are inside Six Flags New England. I'm so excited. There's Thunderbolts Scream, I've never been on screen here, but it uh, looks like a lot of fun and uh, we're going over to Wicked Cyclone first That's on the ERT and I'm just oh my god. I'm so excited to be here today um, Yeah, so uh, we're gonna go to Wicked Cyclone first. I'm pretty sure there's ERT on it this morning. So, uh, yeah, it's gonna be a lot of fun. But there's Goliath, really crappy inverted boomerang, giant inverted boomerang, rather. And, uh, then you got Flashback, which is mediocre behind it. But, uh, yeah, it's gonna be pretty cool. Alright, guys, we are back. So I just got off a pandemonium, and, uh, there it goes right now. Actually, really fun, a lot better than I remember. And, uh, it's, uh, definitely my favorite spinning coaster I've been on. I also got on Wicked Cyclone front row, which was amazing. Um, so I've been on front only once so far today. I think right now I want to go to Great Chase just to get the kitty credit. And then I'm going to go do uh, Wicked Cyclone some more because that ride is amazing. Um, so yeah, oh my god. It's just, I love the color scheme for this ride. It's a lot of fun and uh, definitely one of my favorite coasters I've been on. So uh, yeah, we're going to go to the kitty coaster now. So we'll see you guys once we get off. Here goes Pandemonium. Alright guys, so I just got off a great chase, the park's ENF Miller Kitty Coaster. Um, I don't know, out of all the ENF Miller Kitty Coaster I've been on, this is like, it's a good one. I like it better than Great Pumpkin Coaster at uh, King's Dominion. And it's honestly not bad, it's weird that it only goes around once. Uh, but it is one of the bigger uh, models, um, so yeah, it's pretty fun. But I'm just going to go to Wicked Cyclone again, get a lot of rides on that before the line builds up. And, uh, yeah, I think I'll also do flashback while I'm there. I might save Goliath for later. Um, actually, you know what? I think, uh, right now I might go do Riddler to get the credit over with. Um, so yeah, I think I might do that. Uh, but yeah, so I guess I'll, uh, I'll talk to you guys after I get off Riddler. All right, guys, we are back. So Riddler Revenge over here is stuck on the lift hill. So, uh, I mean, I'm not disappointed. I really want the credit, though. But uh, right now I'm going over to Joker to get that credit. And I'm excited to see which one's better, the one here or the one at Great Adventure. So uh, yeah, because um, this one's newer than the one at Great Adventure. The one at Great Adventure opened in 2016 when this was one of the three uh, that opened in 20, uh, 2017. And as you can see, this one has a different color scheme. But I'm really looking forward to the ride. It looks a lot of fun. I don't know if there's loose sort of policy or not. I hope not, but uh, there might be. So anyway, See you guys in the next clip. All right, guys, so I just got off a Joker, and honestly, the one in Great Adventure is a lot better. By far, the one over here, I didn't even get one flip, uh, and that's pathetic uh, for a free spin, but it was uh, it was pretty fun. Uh, I really want to get on Riddler. I know I'm crazy for saying that, but, and I know it's going to be rough. It's not Nor'easter we're talking about. This is still has the old uh, trains, not the old trains, the old uh, track, but um, yeah, so I really want to get on this. Looks really fun. Uh, it is an SLC though, but. I'm gonna make sure to ride front row. Uh, that's the key to these things. 
plus uh, it has a new restraint, so that's why I'm going on it. If it had the old ones, I'd be, I'd say, forget about it. But yeah, here it goes right now, and then we'll see you guys once we get off. All right, guys, I just got off a of Harley Quinn's Insanity. What an amazing ride. I'm, I'm just extremely excited for Wonder Woman Lasso Truth at Six Flags Great Adventure next year. And uh, ours is going to be taller, but the view was amazing on this ride. I waited a good hour for this because it kept on breaking down. But I will say it was worth the wait. It's a great flat ride and a great addition to the park. And uh, I don't know, guys. It's I'm awesome. But um, anyway, we're going on Riddler right now. The park's SLC. And, uh, yeah, my buddy Shane said it's about the same as Nor'easter. Uh, uh, he preferred it more, but I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm pretty excited, though. I love the color scheme for this. And uh, we're just going to go ahead and get on it. So guys, I just got off of Riddler Revenge here at Six Flags, New England. Honestly, it wasn't too bad. Oh, it wasn't as bad as I thought it'd be. Um, it is an SLC though, so it still sucks. Yeah, the ride just hit its brakes, so that's why you probably couldn't hear me just then. But uh, yeah, so that was credit number 135. Not too bad in my opinion. Um, so yeah, I got the three credits I was missing. We got that, we got Joker, and Great Chase. And uh, Joker was actually a lot of fun. Not too bad, not too, uh, wasn't the best free spin, but uh, I like Joker at Great Adventure better. But uh, right now I'm actually going to Flash Pass headquarters to go sort something out with my uh, pass. But uh, I also still got to get on Superman, Gotham City Gauntlet, uh, Flashback, Goliath. Um, I want to get on Wicked Cyclone again, uh, Batman again. I, I still got to get on Catwoman too, but you know, I, I got a front row ride on Wicked Cyclone, which is good enough for me. But I also want to get on Scream, and uh, maybe New England Skyscraper. It looks pretty fun in my opinion. But uh, yeah, so see you guys in the next clip. Alright guys, I just got off the of Superman the Ride, front row, waited about an hour and a half for the ride, just because there are boarding passes, there's one train, I knew I had to get on this coast, I also have a skip the line pass uh, to use um, for night rides, but uh, yeah, also I'm pretty sure in that building that's where Cyborg's going, their new Chance Rides Freestyle, and uh, it's definitely going to be a really unique one. But uh, yeah, so uh, anyway, just want to record this little short clip. I'm going to eat right now at Johnny Rockets. And uh, yeah, so see you guys once we're done eating. All right, guys, I just got off of a night ride back row on Wicked Cyclone. What an amazing coaster. And I'm going to be honest with you, this just beat Twisted Timbers. And uh, I know a lot of people compare the two because they're kind of on the same level. But I actually prefer Wicked Cyclone now. Um, and I know Twisted Timbers has the barrel roll drop and everything, but it's um, this ride's just nuts at uh, night back row. And uh, right now I'm going to get my last ride on Superman, um, so you get a back row ride on that. And then the ERT starts on Riddler, Harley Quinn's Insanity, Joker, uh, Batman Dark Knight. I'm extremely excited for the ERT. And the ERT this morning was great because I got on Pandemonium over here. Um, there it goes. I got on that when I didn't have to wait at all. And I got a front row ride on Wicked Cyclone. I was the first person on it today. So that was a lot of fun. And it was just such an amazing ride. Really, really enjoyed it. But, oh my god. Comment if you guys heard that. <laughs> anyway, though, all jokes aside, that was an amazing ride. Really enjoyed it. And uh, also, something I noted earlier, uh, this Fright Fest prop here, uh, Fright Fest, um, that actually, they have, they have the same thing at Great Adventure. Uh, where, where the Batmobile is, so they have that uh, during Fright Fest there, so it's pretty cool how Six Flags does that. 
But anyway, though, we're gonna go get my last ride on Superman. I'll see you guys once I get off. All right, guys, we are back. So I actually just remembered I didn't get on uh, Gotham City Gauntlet yet today. Um, so yeah, right now I'm on my way to go to, uh, ride Superman over here. So I'm pretty excited for the night ride. Plus, I have my uh, skip the line pass, which is gonna come in very handy. And uh, yeah, so I just love this area of the park. Uh, probably my favorite area uh, of the park by far. Um, just because it's right up next to the uh, Connecticut River. And you got this awesome intimate mega coaster here. Which is great. But uh, anyway, I was hoping to get on, you know, Scream. But I don't think I will. Also, I'm kind of bummed out Kryptonite Collider was closed. But um, next time I come here, uh, Cyborg will be here. And that looks uh, like a lot of fun. But uh, anyway, though, we're going to go on Superman. And then maybe, just maybe, Gotham City Gauntlet after. All right, guys, I just got off of Superman the Ride. Wow, oh my god, that was amazing at nighttime. That was actually my first ever night ride on it. Um, Cause last time I was here two years ago for the first time, I was uh, really just cut on time. Plus the park closed at eight that day instead of nine today. I'm actually gonna be here until 10. Plus we have ERT on Joker, Harley Quinn, Batman, Dark Knight. I might ride Riddler once, I don't know. It really depends how I'm feeling. But it's just been an amazing day at the park. Um, I got on a lot of rides I missed uh, a couple of years ago. But unfortunately, I didn't get on Gotham City Gauntlet today or Catwoman uh, Whip, but I still got on uh, uh, rides I missed out, like Scream, uh, New England Sky Screamer. Uh, let's see, I got the Kitty Credit, um, Riddler Revenge, and I rode the coaster that wasn't even here yet. It wasn't even here when I uh, was at the park, which is Joker, so uh, that was my second free spin, and I'm riding two more next month. Batman the Ride at Six Flags Vista, Texas, and Joker at Six Flags Over, Texas. So yeah, it's, it's awesome though. So anyway, uh, we're gonna go over to the Gotham City area of the RT. I will see you guys over in the area. All right, guys, I just got off a Joker here at New England, and uh, I rode the green side this time. My first ever ride was on the purple. And let me just say, it was a much better ride on the green. I got, it's, I still like Great Adventures better uh, because I got more flips there. But um, yeah, I got two flips, so I actually went upside down this time. So that was a lot of fun. Another thing I like about this Joker is that the screen actually works over here. Like, it has sound and everything. It looks really good. So I'm happy about that. But right now, I'm going to get a few rides on Batman the Dark Knight before I go. And then I'll end off the night with Harley Quinn's Insanity to hype up Wonder Woman Lasso of Truth at Six Flags Great Adventure next year. Anyway guys, we'll see you guys once we get off Batman The Dark Knight. Alright guys, that is going to do it for us here at Six Flags New England today. I honestly had a blast. I'm really glad I finally got to return to this park after two years of not coming here. And uh, it's just been an amazing day. Got on a lot of coasters. We only missed two. We only missed Gotham City Gauntlet and uh, Catwoman Whip. But I already have both those credits, so it's not really a big deal. Plus, uh, we have a uh, clone of Catwoman, which is better. Harley Quinn over at Great Adventure. And then obviously we have Dark Knight, which blows Gotham City Gauntlet out of the water. But uh, overall, a really good visit. Superman over there at night was amazing. Better than the one at uh, Six Flags America and definitely better than Nitro. And uh, it's just been an amazing day. So anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you want more content like this, uh, be sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video. See you guys.